Welcome to Voices of the Writers. I'm your host, Adam Skull, bringing you a new dimension of poetry readings, songwriters, vignettes, and stories with music and sounds for the Eat Sleep Write podcast. Discover new writers. Learn about their huge body of work on Eat Sleep Write. The Final View by A.L. Mabry Read by Adam Skull Jack let his gaze fall from the stars to the Hudson River glimmering below. He needed peace, some quiet within his soul. His son's lacrosse stick laid across his lap, a stoic reminder of what he lost. His last evening with Sammy came to mind. Together, they repaired the dishwasher picked up earlier that day. Most of the money Jack earned from the repairs went towards Sammy's lacrosse expenses. He dropped his chin and his eyes settled on the concrete oasis below him. Fear and regret warred with his desire to finish what he came to do. His girlfriend's face fluttered through his mind, but he waved her away. Cindy would be fine without him. She never got along with Sammy, and Jack knew she would never give him the space to grieve. He let the memories dance in his head, each one adding its own weight to his heart. He remembered newborn Sammy cradled in his arms, taking his first steps and learning to ride a bike. He thought about Sammy's first day of school, first lacrosse practice, and first dance. The memories flooded faster and faster, his heart racing to keep up. Splotches of blood still dotted the handle where Sammy's face rested in those final moments. He took the hit so hard The entire field went silent. Jack clenched his eyes against the memory, gripped the stick against his chest, and flung himself forward. Thank you for joining us for another edition of Voices of the Writers, located at eatsleepwrite.net. Bringing you a new dimension of poetry, songwriters, vignettes and stories with music and sounds, for Eat Sleep Write. We would like to hear from you. Engage with us. Send your comments and questions to comments at eatsleepwrite.net, or leave a comment at the end of the podcast page. Join us again for Voices of the Writers on Eat Sleep Write.